Hi there. I was looking on the Mega Millions website and Mega Millions is a lotto style game that's uh, popular in the USA. And um, Mega Millions, there it's, uh, there's one chance in 302 million um, of winning the uh, first prize and that's uh, one chance in 302 million for every game that you play. And I thought to myself, that's a, a massive uh, number. Um, what, to, how can I really relate to that number? Or how, what can I compare it to, to help me understand how large that number actually is? And then I thought to myself, well, this game of Mega Millions is only open to people that live in the USA. And so the USA has a population of around 325 million. So 325 million is fairly similar to 302 million. A little bit different, but uh, fairly similar. So I thought to myself, well, what about if you think of it in terms of the USA president? So USA president. So there can only ever be one president at any one time of the USA. So to be the, the president then is one chance in 325 million, million, that's it. So to be the president then is a similar odds to winning mega millions with, um, with uh, just one game. So you've got one chance of being president, one chance of mega million being winning mega millions, and that's a similar odds. And the second one I was going to talk about is lightning strikes. And they always uh, trot out lightning strikes to sort of compare it to large uh, odds for um, for lotto wins. So I thought I'd do light lightning strikes as well. And I googled it and found that there's 51 fatalities in any year in the USA um, from lightning strikes. So they've got 51 chances in 325 million of being struck by lightning. So it's much more, the odds are higher to be uh, more chance to be struck by lightning than to win the mega millions. And another one I thought to myself, well, what about USA billionaires? And I thought to myself before I found the answer that there'd only be a handful of billionaires in the USA, but there actually, there actually was 540 currently billionaires in the USA. So to be a billionaire in the USA, you've got 540 chances in 325 million. So it's much um, uh, more chance, a uh, higher chance of being a billionaire than winning, winning mega millions. And you've got 10 more chances in a way, or m more to 10 times as many chances of being a billionaire than being struck by lightning, which is another uh, interesting um, observation out of those numbers. And the last one I was thinking I'd look at was what are the odds of being famous in the USA? And yeah, this was uh, this was a little bit more difficult to find these numbers, but um, I've had a crack at it, and I'll go through my my um, my calculations of working out how many famous people there are in the USA. So um, Wikipedia, there was some uh, search thing that Wikipedia people people that are on Wikipedia that they have around 600,000 listings for people all over the world that are on Wikipedia. And if we've got a world population of 7 billion, then we divide the 600,000 by 7 billion, and then we multiply that by the population of the USA, which is 325 million, and we multiply that out. I'll do that on my trusty calculator. So it's 600,000 divided by 7 billion. 7 with 9 zeros. Yep. And we multiply that by 325 million. It's 
there's approximately 27,800 famous people in the USA. So to be famous then, you have, there is 27,800 chances in 325 million of being famous. So there's much more likelihood that you're going to be famous than uh, win mega millions, many, many more chances. And if you think about famous people, that might include uh, politicians, sports stars, people on TV, uh, local uh, sort of celebrities. So it's probably possible that there could be 27,000 actors, TV stars, the 27,800 famous people in the USA. So there we go. So just as a recap then, so it's a similar chance of you being USA president as to winning mega millions. You've got more chances of being struck by lightning, more chances of being a billionaire, and many more chances of being famous in the USA than of uh, winning mega millions with just one game. Okay, well I hope you've uh, enjoyed this video. I hope you found it uh, interesting and entertaining. Thanks for watching and goodbye for now.